Coming up next, the Middlesex West Chamber of Commerce celebrated the four-year anniversary of Cairo Pro Performance Center. Cairo Pro Performance Center celebrated their four-year anniversary being in Acton. The Middlesex West Chamber of Commerce was there for ribbon cutting and Acton TV was on hand to capture the highlights. Welcome. On behalf of Cairo Pro Performance Center, we're so glad to welcome you. I'm Kathleen McDonald with the Middlesex West Chamber of Commerce, and this is being recorded, so that's why I have the, the um, microphone. But um, we're very, very glad to be celebrating with Cairo Pro Performance Center with Dr. Lynn Carlson, Dr. Lovich, and um, with Tina. Um, their fourth year anniversary already which is a milestone. So congratulations you. to you. And uh, we're thrilled to be here and um, we have some wonderful special guests with us. So I will talk about the chamber in a minute, but first I'd like to introduce both Senator Jamie Eldridge and Representative Corey Atkins who have some wonderful presentations to give us, or to give you. Well, good afternoon, I'm State Senator Jamie Eldridge, proud to represent Acton and I wanna thank the chamber uh, for hosting this celebration for Cairo Pro. I, I have to admit, because it's tucked back in this corner off Gray Road, I wasn't as familiar uh, with the place. So um, Kathleen, thank you for organizing this. And I wanted to congratulate Dr. Carlson on the four year anniversary and just having the chance to speak even for, for 10 minutes, uh, both to staff here and a, and a few patients. I, I really have a true sense of the difference you make in so many people's lives and helping people with athletic injuries and other injuries. So. Uh, so thank you so much for all you do here. Uh, I will certainly spread the word uh, about ChiroPro. And I do have a citation here from the Senate, so if you want to stand next to me. It's a citation from the Senate. Be it hereby known that the Massachusetts Senate hereby extends its congratulations to ChiroPro Performance Center of Acton in recognition, and don't miss this, the momentous occasion of your four-year anniversary. That's not used in too many citations, so that's pretty, pretty special. And be it further known that the Massachusetts Senate extends best wishes for continued success. So this is from myself and the Senate President. So congratulations on your four-year anniversary, and thank you for all of you and your staff do. Thank you. Megan Duggan and Gigi Marvin, former Olympians and members of the Boston Pride women's hockey team, share their experiences about Cairo Pro Performance Center. Hi, my name's Megan Duggan and this is Gigi Marvin here. Um, both two-time Olympians with the U.S. women's ice hockey team and also members um, of the Boston Pride within the National Women's Hockey League. Um, both have had uh, experiences with Cairo Pro and could talk for hours about how they saved our lives, um, our careers, and how incredible they are. Um, for me personally, had a really bad injury back uh, before the Sochi Olympics. Um, thought my career was over, frankly thought my, my life was um, never going to be the same. And working with these guys diligently um, really it saved everything, uh, got me back to Playing hockey uh, brought me back to the person that I wanted to be, and um, you know there's a photo out there in their lobby that I signed for them that said, "Thank you for saving my career." But um, today I could say, "Thank you so much for saving my life." But these people actually care about you and follow your career, and whether you're in a professional athlete going to the Olympics or you play um, lacrosse over um, at a prep school, you know it, it doesn't necessarily matter. That's it's not about it's about the person, and they do a great job taking care of our bodies, but also us as people and just really reflecting that. Okay, so my name is Sarah Lepsovich. I am a senior. Um, I live here in Massachusetts. Um, so for, throughout my whole life, I've been playing sports, um, soccer, lacrosse, basketball, you name it, I was playing it. Um, when it came sophomore year, I was on, actually freshman year, I was playing varsity soccer and I suffered a severe concussion. But I took two weeks off, you know, and then I went back to playing soccer and finished out the year. But my parents started to know symptoms. Um, I started I started to get a headache, but I ignored everything because I wanted to play lacrosse and keep playing my sports. So come sophomore year is when the hit that changed everything. I the ball struck me to my right temple. Um, it was in the middle of a soccer game away up in New Hampshire, and it struck me 
on the right temple. And the force of the, the impact of the, the force of the impact of the ball to my head was so forceful that it lifted me up my feet and I slammed my left side of my brain head first onto the turf. Um, and after the game, um, a bell just went off right in that moment. And it wasn't until later that summer where I found Dr. Carlson through my pediatrician. Um, and so the first day here at ChiroPro, um, it was the first examination that lasted more than 20 minutes. It was the first thorough exam anyone was ever done on my brain. Um, and they sat down with me and they told me basically that I wasn't crazy um, and that, um, that they could help me um, with, through an intensive program, which I did. So half of my junior year, I was here two times a day, five days a week, um, doing rehab with them. And it was because of them that I'm standing here today being able to talk because I lost, I couldn't walk anymore, I couldn't talk, I lost all function on the right side of my body because the connection between my brain wasn't reaching the other side of my body and it's because of them that I can now walk, talk and eat and basically do everything that I can, I used to.